we are called to be the disciples of Jesus to quench the thirst and feed the hungry. My dear brothers and sisters in Jesus Christ, when we have worked hard for a whole week, we take a rest or we go to a quiet place to relax and energize ourselves. The background of today's gospel, the 12 apostles had returned from their first mission, all eager to tell Jesus about their new experiences of preaching and healing the sick. But Jesus invited them to a quiet place to take rest for a while. Their hope of relaxing was scattered when they found a great crowd there ahead of them. In his compassion, Jesus puts the people's needs first. These people had thirst to listen to the word of the Lord. As the Lord tells in the book of Amos 8.11 When I send a famine on the land, not a famine of bread or a thirst of water, but of hearing the words of the Lord. This large crowd had gathered to quench their thirst for the word of the Lord in that lonely place. After having quenched their thirst of the word, Jesus recognizes that they are hungry for food and calls on the twelve to serve these thousands by saying, Go and see. Contrast to the come and see of the earlier meetings of the disciples with Jesus. Jesus encourages us to go out and discover the needs of the people. Here the needs are placed within the context of food and the disciples learn that with the Lord they can feed the people. Feeding in the scripture also means teaching. The event is a big teaching event that God in his love is over generous with a love and care which never ends. Within their own hearts, the disciples discovered that and learned that they were the feeder from God to the people. You and I are the same. Whatever our personal gifts and talents are, we can be the feeder line of God to His people in love and care. The sheep without shepherds will find care in the followers of Jesus. Come and see was an invitation to the disciples when they found Jesus. The invitation and the command now is to go and see. Jesus knows there are basic needs in the big crowd that gathers around him. The apostles are to go and see what is needed and what is to be done. Today we are called to be the disciples of Jesus to quench the thirst and feed the hungry. Let us watch and listen today for the needs of the people around us and see how you and I can express the compassion of God.